Okay, now we're into lesson three. I'm trying to develop the lessons in a short format for you so that at any time you don't have to sit, feel like you have to sit and watch a 20 or 30 minute video. So if you want to watch these videos and then come back and preview them again, they're just a matter of a few minutes and will not take you very long to refresh or kind of get a better understanding of how the WordPress recruiting website is going to uh, take place for you. So we've created, if you, if you remember from the last lesson, we went down to appearance and actually went through some of the themes. We just looked through a few of them and picked a, picked a theme. But the thing we were looking for was this custom header, if you remember right. So we can simply, now that we've chosen that as our current theme, we can select the custom header. And you can see that we have the ability to actually change the image for this particular um, website that we're creating. Now, we have to keep in mind that the images need to be in a particular size. So in this particular case, it's 720 by 180 pixels. So I'm going to jump over into another program and show you how you can cr take an image of your office building and then we're going to, going to actually bring that over and use that in our WordPress blog. So we're going to transition over to another program and we're going to create an image in this 720 by 180 pixels to use in our WordPress blog. Now I've jumped over to use a program called Snagit and I have this program from a company called uh, TechSmith. You can download Snagit. It's a software program actually called Snagit and it's from a company called TechSmith.com. Although any photo editing program will work. Now remember our goal is to create a 720 width by 180 pixel background or new header for our WordPress site. So I just simply went into uh, my Snagit and I created a canvas for 720 by 180, added my logo, added some text, and saved that as a JPEG. Now I can jump over into WordPress and upload this image and when I go to my website, the new recruiting website we've created, you can see that it's beginning to take shape. And now I actually have a customized header for my WordPress recruiting website with my logo and some copy about how people can get a hold of me if they want a confidential interview about a career in real estate. So we've created a customized header. Again, remember when you pick out a theme at WordPress, you want to pick out a theme that allows you the ability to customize the header. We've got a lot more work to do on our a recruiting website with lots of changes but it's beginning to take shape and you can see how easy it is to make this website slash blog really look and feel like your company's website.